New at 6, last week we told you that local nurses with the California Nurses Association reached a three-year agreement with Oroville Hospital. Action News Network reporter Camille Acevedo spoke with one of those nurses and shows us what the new deal means for patient care. After being in contract negotiations since 2023, the Oroville Hospital and its registered nurses came to an agreement. How it makes us feel is that we were heard. Registered nurse Christine Goodwin has worked at Oroville Hospital for several years. And as a member of the California Nurse Association, she was at the forefront of the bargaining. Personally, my first thought was just relief. Um, it was a long, hard fight, 10 months in the process. Under the new contract, Goodwin says there are efforts to help retain the nurses that the hospital already has, as well as um, preventing the hospital from being short staff, which she says will help patients receive faster care. And it's just a good thing for everybody. It's a good thing for the patients, the community, the hospital, and it's a good thing for the nurses and the hospital staff. Under the new contract, nurses will also receive the highest level of protective equipment when taking care of patients with COVID-19. They also get an 11% wage increase over the span of three years. Management will take into account the amount of patients in a unit before allowing nurses to call off. We've gone back and forth with negotiations, but primarily um, the picket has shown not only the hospital and the administration, but also the community that we are there for them. We support them. And for our nurses, it shows that uh, the CNA union is there for us as well. And I reached out to Orville Hospital for a statement regarding this new contract. I'm still working to get a response. In Orville, I'm Camille Osvedo for Action News Now, coverage you can count on. The new contract runs for three years. The California Nurses Association currently represents 400 nurses at the Orville Hospital.